Hey guys, it is me again, Reza, and welcome back to my channel and welcome to Vlogmas Day 15. video obviously I am gonna share with you guys how I pack and I'm not really sure if this is I share because I'm really bad at packing I'm not sure if this is gonna be a helpful video or an educational video because I'm the worst packer in the world first so I always overpack second I always pack at the last minute like now it's December 15 my flight is tomorrow December 16 that's why I pack so nice right? <laughs> Galing, diba? But yeah, I'm gonna try my best and share what I usually do, what I usually do, or it's or how my process is when I pack. So yeah, I'm not really proud of how I pack, but I'm gonna try my best to like give some tips and tricks every time I pack because I've I've, I've always wanted to do this video ever since before. Pero yun nga since I'm a procrastinator teenager packer like I pack a day or two days before a trip in dictionary film kasi nagmamadali na ako so yeah I just thought that this video is going to be a good video for vlogmas so welcome to vlogmas day 15 and let's start packing okay, so obviously this is my suitcase and this is not expensive or anything I just got this from Lazada uh dalawa sila I have another one a smaller one pwedeng hand carry and yeah I just got them from the Zada, I think 4,000 or 3,000 for both of them. So yeah, I mean, it's not expensive, it's not Remoa, but it does the trick. I mean, from my point of view, lang, I don't want to spend a lot of money for luggage because, oh my God, because they're tao sa airport. But that's just me. If you want to you want to I don't have I'm going to stick with this one, my suitcase from the Zada. Oh, and I forgot where I'm going. I'm just gonna go home to my hometown, Zamboanga, for the holidays. So, yeah. Of course, I'm gonna use a big suitcase because I'm the queen of overpacker. Overpacking! <laughs> and because... Also, please don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts. And if you guys haven't noticed, my hair is new. So... Yeah, <laughs> I still have a shower from yesterday. Kahapon ko pinagawa yung buko. I also have a vlog about that vlog must day 14, which I will upload before this. So, I'm gonna link it here. Please watch it. I'm gonna go home for the holidays. Um, so my clothes are gonna be a mixture of formal clothes, everyday clothes, casual clothes, beach clothes, and like party clothes, Christmas party clothes, and pangbahay and workout clothes. If I can work out, <laughs> normal people would like just use half of this bag for a three week tip. But well, we all love an overpacking queen. <laughs> I don't know, I just can't do it. Like, I every time I go on a trip, I try my best to pack as little as I can, but I just end up packing so much. <laughs> it's such a bad habit of mine, and I always try to change it, pero hindi talaga. Let's try next year. Sana. Give me a solution. So yeah, basically this video is just gonna be a video of me trying my best to pack and failing for sure. <laughs> but I think the important part or the important lesson in this video is like the systematic or like the process or stages I go through when I pack for a trip that I'm very organized and careful at. The system is very smart. So if you guys wanna know how I pack my clothes or how I, pl how I plan my Outfits for a trip, just keep on watching. Okay, so first thing I do if I have a trip coming up, I go shopping. I usually go online shopping these days. I haven't seen the insides of H&M or Forever 21 in ages, in like months, three months. But yeah, basically if I have a trip, I do some shopping online, affordable shopping of course. And then I make sure that clothes are bagay sa place that I'm going to 
if I'm gonna go to like a beachy place, I'm gonna shop for swimsuit, swimwear, I'm gonna shop for sundresses, and then if I'm gonna go to like a wintry place, of course, I'm gonna shop for coats. Alang na naman mag bikini ako sa winter, di ba? But yeah, that's the first thing I do. I like makeup outfits in my head, and then I go, I usually go on Pinterest or We Heart It, look for inspirations, and then I screenshot them all, I save them all on my phone, and then I look at them, tapos mag isip ako ng possible outfits for that possible trip for that possible trip, for that trip but since i'm just gonna go home to zamboanga i don't really need that much new clothes or like i don't really need intense online shopping or intense preparation because i'm just gonna go home no one but i did a little bit of shopping for christmas clothes for christmas party outfits so i'm gonna show it to you guys later then but you know, I'm not that intense. But I'm gonna share it with you guys. So yeah, even if it's just home, I always wanna look good for myself. So I always plan my outfits anywhere I go, height sub zumbuanga bayan. Like I always wanna look cute. <laughs> but yeah, first thing that's the first thing I do. And then when the clothes arrive, I stock them up in one basket. I usually like put them up here in my cloth rack clothing rack. Wait, I'm gonna show you guys. Like there. But so I'm not OC ako if I see different colors na nakasabit dyan. That's why it's all just pink now. So I, I've just put them in a basket. Look at the basket. <laughs> so this is the... What do you call this? Uh, this is the pile of clothes that I've been stacking up for my trip back home. Um, these aren't new clothes. Dito lahat bago. Like, the things that I bought online, nilagay ko dito, tinambak ko dito. And then, every time I go through my closet, tapos may nakita ako na gusto ko, I just grab it and put it here. That's why it's kind of full. So, okay. Mabigat. <laughs> so, usually before a trip, I start planning outfits three weeks. Actually, even months. It just depends. Pag may naisip lang ako damit. And then, pag malapit na yung trip, I go through my closet again and I pick things that mix well with the things that I bought online so and then when they're all in the basket i sort it out again like tatanggalin ko ulit yung mga like i'll rethink it again and decide kung ano talaga yung nadalhin ko and iiwan ko and then so i'm gonna put the old like the clothes that i'm not gonna use now i mean the clothes that i've decided that i'm not gonna use now i'm gonna put them back in the closet para mas mabilis ko mo organize or like ma mix and match lahat and then after i sort it out I look at it, I feel ko sobrang dami pa rin niya. So sort out ko siya ulit. And then after that, I will try them on na. And then play some music and dance for like hours. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I usually do. Ta try ko sila and then I'm gonna check it out if okay na ba. Mix and match, figure it out, figure out if okay na ba. And then take photos. Yeah, I take photos of the outfit so I won't forget. And then. Oh, and then if I'm gonna go like on a trip, nga, like vacation, talaga, isipin ko what outfit I would wear in this day. Like for example, I'm gonna go to Bali, and this day we're gonna go see the monkeys. So I'm gonna wear something I can move in, and then if the next day we're gonna go drinking, then I'm gonna decide or gonna make an out or gonna put up an outfit na I can dance in and look cute in if ever there are hot guys in Bali who say hi to me. <laughs> but yeah, after I narrow the clothes down, I'm gonna decide which outfit for what day. I sound stupid. But yeah, I do that. <laughs> I mean, that really helps because like, it's gonna get more organized and you're gonna end up bringing less clothes because my outfit can for this certain activity or day. So guys, if you're gonna if you're not gonna plan it before the trip, when you think of Isipin mo pa kung ano suotin mo for tomorrow, which is pa hassle. And like if ginawa mo na siya before, when you wake up in, in, your, in your vacation, you're just gonna open your closet. Okay, this is what I'm gonna wear for this day. Boom, outfit on, ready to go, de ba? Okay, I sounded kind of smart there. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that's weird or if that's normal, but I do that because because I know some people just get jeans, clothes, and then just get whatever they can from their suitcase. But I don't do that. I'm a content hoe. <laughs> so, yeah, I always make sure that there's an outfit perfect for this day. Kung ano man yung gagawin namin on that day. Na bagay yung outfit sa gagawin that day or sa pupuntahan. 
for the content, joke lang, and for the comfortability. If you guys find me weird or, I don't know, crazy, it's okay. <laughs> I love fashion, I love clothes, I love style, so you can judge me. <laughs> okay, now that I'm done with like the basics of what I usually do, like the first steps, let us try some outfits on. So, so far, I feel ko, I'm kind of organized, but I mean, not organized, organized, but like messy, but organized in my own way. <laughs> but yeah, let's start trying clothes on. Oh wait, I'm not yet done pala. Oh wait, one more thing. While I try clothes on, I try like shoes with them na rin. Like, for example, this outfit. This is gonna be like an airport outfit. So, pag suot ko na siya, maghahanap na rin ako ng shoes na bagay. And then, I'm gonna put it in one, like, one pile na din. And from there, I'm gonna choose what shades <laughs> I wanna wear. So, yeah, any shades over there with the outfit. And then, after that, I am gonna decide what the, um, what do you call this? What accessory I'm gonna wear, like what earrings, what watch, what bag. I'm so weird. Nakakahiya. But now that I'm saying it out loud, out loud sobrang parang tapala. Like the effort I put in my clothes and my outfits, so crazy. But it's okay, I enjoy it, I like it. Like, I genuinely like seeing myself in front of a mirror and looking pretty. <laughs> so, let's go and try some clothes on. I'm gonna do like a short or like a mini haul from the things that I got recently, like the last month for December or the things na kakabili ko lang. So, I'll show it to you guys. Okay, so this one I got from, uh, where did I get this? Dubai. Hindi ako masyado shopping sa Dubai. I think I just got a few things lang talaga. So, this. I haven't worn this. I worn this, I wore this once lang pala. But I haven't, like, wala pa akong picture with this one. So, yeah, I'm gonna bring this home because it's very comfortable. So, yeah. I mean, you can't appreciate it like this. But I swear, it's so nice. Okay. Okay, so I got these from Zalora. So, sobrang cute nila because I mean if you guys don't know yet I'm a big fan of Bella Hadid and lately she's been wearing like knit sweater na, like knit sweaters with buttons on them and I was on the hunt for them for like a month or more than a month Just may nahanap ako sa Zalora so I ordered three of them I think the red one is in the laundry pinalaba ko because I wore it the other day but I got three of them and so nice. I hate plastic. Literally, I hate plastic. Like, I like it because it's very sexy, but it's very conservative. I mean, I like how it's very stylish, pero sobrang ano niya. Sobrang ano. Wait. Ta-da! Ta-da! I mean, I don't know if you guys like this style or like, like this kind of clothing, but you know, that's just me. I'm not gonna pair it with shorts though because I hate shorts because my legs are fat. <laughs> but yeah, I just open one button to make it look more like trendy and then I fold the sleeves a little bit. Paramas mukhang young. <laughs> because I feel like if nakakita kayo ng knit sweater, some people usually think that oh, that's for old people. <laughs> but yeah, but yeah, this is so cute. And what Bella usually does is like she opens like all the buttons except the first one because well she's sexy and we're not but <laughs> it's really cute but like yeah and she usually does that but Nita is sexy so we cannot do that <laughs> so let's close these I feel like I'm gonna wear this to one of like the reunions or family gatherings but I'm not gonna wear shorts I'm gonna wear jeans so yeah Voila! Next outfit. Of course, my statement outfit. Big t-shirt that I stole from my brother. This is Supreme. Am I cool yet? <laughs> uh, this is from Supreme. We got this in Guam. Um, I don't know what this guy is though, but I've been into like graphic tees or shirts lately. And then, of course, my cycling shorts that everyone hates. Like, I swear, my friends hate my shorts in the, i mean these shorts i don't know why they're so com they're so comfortable but yeah i think i came up with 
five sets of outfits like this na na t-shirt tapo cycling shorts i have a lot of cycling shorts beware some buanga cycling shorts are coming for you <laughs> but yeah this is one outfit that i like this is like my go-to outfit when i'm when i need to go out and then i just want to look chill and still cute for me if you need cute para sa inyo it's okay but it's cute for me so yeah and then some shades to finish this look <laughs> okay next outfit so you guys know i've been loving plaid bottoms lately so of course i'm gonna bring this so i just got this from zaful actually but i think meron is forever 21 h m and like zara but i got this from zaful lang very affordable very cheap <laughs> So yeah, and then this top I got from Zalora for I think 400 or 300 long. I super love this. Of course, I'm gonna bring like super cute chill outfits in case I wanna go eat sa tea. But I think my dad won't allow me to wear this in Zamboanga, lalo na sa Andes. But he will never know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But yeah, this shirt is super cute. It says Tri-State and then what's this? Thunder Basketball. So this is actually like it, ha it says Rudy Bok on the back. I don't know if you can see it. So yeah, it says Rudy Bok here. Is that how you pronounce it? But it's Rudy Bok here. And I'm gonna cut it. Para maging crop top siya. So and then shorts from H&M. I think I can't remember. But yeah, I super love shorts like this. I have a black one and yellow one as well. Okay, one more outfit. I got this from Shop Copper. Super super cute. Kinda of chubby right now, so see that. But I'm gonna try and lose that when I get to Zumba. I'm gonna try my best to lose weight and diet. So super nice. Yeah. Who has the ginger? Who has the ginger? Three, six, nine girls wanna drink wine. Tell the man not to waste your time. If the man broke, the man he a joke. So you gotta get loose with the henny and the coke. Three, two, one, girls wanna have fun. If the man don't. <sighs> okay, that was pretty tiring. So let me just drink water first. Hmm, <sighs> the <clears throat> Okay, so after that process, I'm gonna put like. <sighs> I need a second wait. Okay, I'm good. Okay, I'm good. Okay, after that process, I'm gonna stack them up. So after that process, na hatambak na sila dyan. Like, ito yung gadalhin ko. Ito yung hindi na. And then I'm gonna put them here. <laughs> and then I'm gonna move on to shoes. I'm gonna pick what shoes I'm gonna bring. I haven't decided yet. Napagod na ako. So I'm just gonna pick the shoes that I'm gonna bring to Zamboanga with me later. After I lie down, lay down in bed and rest for a while. But yeah, I'm gonna choose what shoes I'm gonna bring, what bags, and then I'm gonna move on to what makeup I'm gonna bring and like my, I don't know, toothbrush and basa toilet stuff. So yeah, and then my jewelry, and then I'm gonna pick. I, most probably, I'm just gonna bring like pearl earrings and hoop earrings. So yeah, basically that is how I pack my outfits for a trip <laughs> and then I always I usually bring like a backpack when I travel but ever since Europe I've decided to bring like ganitong bag na because when I bring a backpack like oh wait that's not focusing yeah because when I bring a backpack hindi kasha yung mga gamit ko I mean kasha but sobrang bigat and my laptop doesn't usually fit my backpacks because they're, they're small. So, I'm going to put it in my friend. And I'm going to put it in the two laptops that he has with his and mine. So, I've decided na I mean, I bought like something like this. Not, I mean, you don't, you don't really need this exactly. But something like this, like big and very like Daming pa tayo ilagay yan. See, so kasing laptop. And then yeah, I really suggest that you have a bag like this. Like, it's really big and you can put a lot of stuff in it, like charger, your laptop, your power bank, passport, and it's very very handy. So yeah, that's another travel tip for me. Instead of bringing like a backpack, just bring this and boom, easy. <laughs> so yeah, that is. Basically, how I pack 
for a trip. Um, some of the shoes that I think I'm gonna bring, pinot aside, gonna here. But I'm not yet sure if she, I'm gonna bring these to Talaga. And then, of course, slippers. These are Spartan slippers from my best friend. Oh, and there's a sunny face lipstick here. I'm gonna do a review about this. So, so yeah, that is it for today's video. Um, I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm gonna try and edit this right away. So I'm gonna upload it now because I actually had fun filming this video. Kahit na pagod. Oh, one last travel tip, pala. When you like put your clothes inside your suit, excuse me. When you put your clothes inside your suitcase, do not like fold them like this because it's gonna take space. Like what I usually do, I think everyone does this. Someone is I like roll them. What me and my yeah yeah my ate usually do is like and we fold it into rolls and then stack them up together because it's gonna conserve more space and mas marami kang malalagay. So yeah, one last tip. That that's one last tip from me. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much again for watching. Merry Christmas, advanced Merry Christmas. I am so excited for the holidays. Let's bring it on, holidays 2018. See you guys in Zamboanga. And I mean, I think like half of my subscribers are from Zamboanga. So see you guys in Zamboanga. If you guys see me, say hi. Please don't be shy because when I la when I went home last last week, I got like two messages saying that they saw me though. In case you see, tapos mo hindi daw ako approachable. Just go, just say hi to me. Of course, I'm gonna say hi back because we're friends, we're family here, people. But yeah, thank you guys so much again for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys learned something from this video. And if you did, <laughs> please hit the like button. Um, please don't forget to subscribe. And please don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!